so now let's see on the schematic of this project so the first one you have the board Arduino and it is optional if you have a speaker and the fire LED and connect the first LED to the pin 13 of the digital pin to the first and the 12 to second and 10 and so on like this and connect to pin 8 of the Arduino connect to the a speaker or you can use a buffer an active buffer module and connect to the ground like this so let's start with the code of the Arduino right now code of my project like this so I am now on the char F is F and the pin 13 A B C D like this and sound is a pin 8 out of digital pin like this And if on the while loop, if the serial available is greater than zero, and F serial read, if I recall to 98, because the 98 is the system of at the ASCII, the code that can read it an uh, Arduino and uh, that convert the number to tag. And about the 97 is A, so and 98 is B, 99C, so on. And I would like to tell you about the number of this. Uh, to control yeah here yeah. 49 is number 1 50 is number 2 and so on and uh, a capital A is 65 and B 66 so I hope you can find this on the Google and now let's and it A on about the first LED a digital with a high so we will flash and print out the A on about the LED one so I want to use the the speaker so you can write a tune and a pin 8 and it is a frequency that of your speaker and it is the time or the sound of the speaker and so on like this number one I want to turn off LED1 and 98 turn on LED2 and like this and so on and you can copy or download my code below on the YouTube channel yeah and the two conditions below is 65 A or R I mean that if we write the copy all A The all of the LED will turn on, and the tone will 
will sound third term, three term, yeah. and this B capital B it all turn out. So let's look with our controller now. We upload the code to the Arduino board. It is a serial monitor to control your LED. So I want to write A the LED one will all So I will show you with my tutorial too how to uh, write this code to A, B, C on a turn on or off. Yeah. 